Hi guys! I wanted to show you guys how to play one of my favorite math games. Um, it's called Set, and it was introduced to me several years ago by a friend, and we have been hooked ever since. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the box and show you what's inside, and it comes with some directions, but I find it's best to be um, taught this game by somebody who already knows how to play it because the directions can be a little bit confusing. And so it comes with 80 cards, and the cards have different... Um, different images on them. So they have squigglies and diamonds and they have different colors and shadings. Um, they have some ovals and um, purple, green, and red. And you'll find them shaded, filled, or empty. So these cars that I showed you happen to be sets and that's what we're going to try to make. And, um, and here are the directions, some of the instructions on how to play the game. So, um, first off, I mix up the cards, and then you want to place 12 cards face up, and you always have uh, 12 cards facing up. So once you make a set, which is three cards, then you add another um, three cards um, to the group. And so uh, you can play, play this with two or more um, people. And I just pulled up something that's not a set, because two of them are red, and two of them are empty. So um, let's go ahead and actually look for a set. So it takes a few seconds, and I'm playing by myself right now, so uh, not quite as fun. But here we go. So um, this is a set. It's They're all green, um, but they have different shadings. And that one is uh, empty, and it's an oval, and that's um, like striped and diamonds, and this is filled and squiggly. So this makes a set. So then you just put this aside, and whoever finds the set gets to keep those cards so that you can figure out at the end um, who has the most sets. So I went ahead and put another um, set of cards down, and now we just want to look for another set. And if you really can't find a set, then you can add three more cards um, to the, to the group until you can find um, a set. So here's another set. Um, they're all different colors and they are different shapes. That's the squiggly, it's purple, and it's empty. And this is oval, green, and filled. And these are diamonds that are striped and red. And the numbers were different too. I forgot to say there's, you know, they were all different numbers. So let's look for another set. And I, I'm just letting the video run for a few seconds just so that you can play along with me. So here's a set. They're all red, but they are different shapes, different numbers, and different fills. So let's put that aside and try one more time. So this one, they're they all have three and they're all filled but they're different colors and they're different shapes. So you just keep playing this until there are no more cards left in the deck. Uh, so here are some pictures of what other um, configurations would look like for a set. And um, the, these ones are all diamonds and they're all green and they're all two uh, but they all have different fills. Uh, this is not a set because the um, purple diamonds are filled and the green squiggly is filled as well, but they're different numbers. So here we have different numbers, different colors, and different fills. So that's a set. And this is another set as well. And I hope that this was enough information to get you guys playing one of my favorite games. It's great for all ages. Alright guys, take care.